Let's dive into Klaviyo's powerful reporting APIs. Whether you're a developer building custom reports or a marketer looking to make data-driven decisions, these APIs will help you analyze your campaign and flow performance. Before we get into it, make sure to give a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Now let's pass it to Michaela, who will walk you through how to use reporting APIs. There are two categories of reports you can create with reporting APIs, values reports and series reports. Let's walk through how to analyze campaign and flow performance programmatically with these two types of reports. Values reports return campaign or flow statistics over a specific time frame. For example, let's say we want to look at open rate, click rate, and total placed order value for campaigns sent in the last 30 days. For this example, let's call the query campaign values endpoint within the reporting API to create a campaign values report. Using Klaviyo's Postman collection, I will navigate to the Query Campaign Values endpoint. I first need to specify which statistics I want to look at. In this case, open rate, click rate, and conversion value. Then, I will need to input the conversion metric ID. This is a six-digit ID of the conversion metric we want to look at. In my case, placed order. To find this ID, navigate to Klaviyo and click on the Metrics tab. Click on Placed Order. In the URL, copy the six-digit ID that comes after metric. Paste this into the body of your API call. The last thing we need to set is a time frame, so last 30 days in my case. Once you've set your parameters, send your API call to quickly and easily retrieve performance data for every campaign sent in the last 30 days. You can also add a filter to filter results to a specific campaign or campaign channel. Use a series report to break down flow performance over time. Series reports provide statistics by time interval. For example, let's use the query flow series endpoint to see how our abandoned cart flow has performed every month this year. Again, I'll add the statistics I am interested in open rate, click rate, and conversion value, as well as a time frame, such as this year. The next step is to set an interval, or how we want to group statistics. Since I am interested in monthly performance, my interval will be monthly. I need to again input the conversion metric ID, which is the ID of the place order metric we copied before. You can also add an optional filter to filter by flow, flow message, or message channel. To see only statistics about the abandoned cart flow, I'll filter by the ID of this flow, which you can find in the flow URL. Once you've inputted your parameters, click Send to see month-over-month -month abandoned cart flow performance. Use Klaviyo's reporting APIs to automate reporting on flow and campaign performance with just a few clicks. If you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe for more API tutorials. Can't get enough APIs? Check out the description below for links to developer documentation designed to help you write custom integrations and use Klaviyo's APIs.